Um, that only speaks to quantity. I, I do have more comedy specials than any comedian breathing or dead, so I understand the question. Uh, that's only seven more than Richard Pryor. And you have seven more, more than Richard Pryor? Six more than Martin Lawrence and six more than uh, Chris Rock. Are you serious? Five more than Dave Chappelle, even though he put out four. In, and uh, the next Are you one, serious, Cat? You put out that many? Those are just facts, sir. <laughs> how, how many? How many is that total? Nine. So you've done nine yes. filmed comedy stand-up what, specials without ever getting financed or having a deal with anybody. You did them by yourself? Yes, I own them one hundred percent. I have the top two comedy specials on Showtime, HBO, Comedy Central, and we just moved to Netflix. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why now, they don't. I, that's I did, why they I don't didn't promote, know that. Nobody does. They don't promote it or sell the. Items after they come out because I own them lock, stock, and barrel, and I don't have any uh, Caucasian partners or right. people that invest. I'm 50. I've never had a bank loan or a car lease in my life. Are you serious? That's correct. So, so has you know we always hear like these comedians coming to say, oh, they got the big Netflix deal. Has has I, like I'm Netflix on, or anybody I'm ever hit my, Cat Williams and I, said, I'm on my 15th consecutive 100 city tour. On the exact day that Monique was asking for a Netflix boycott, Netflix had just cut me a check for $2 million for the special that I got paid $300,000 to do in Jacksonville. <laughs> wow. Yeah! Alrighty then. Are you serious? <laughs> or I'm really good at jokes, you tell me. No, <laughs> I think you serious, bro. That's I, I just say, are you serious? Because because that's interesting news that people Thanks need to Thanks to Atlanta, know. Pimp Chronicles has already grossed over twenty. Four million dollars alone as one special. Wow! Because of Atlanta, like what, there, are, there your... are parts of the population that feel like I'm from Atlanta and I'm from Ohio, yeah. and have never said anything differently. All right. Well, what, we what, you what's your, your your thoughts on Netflix? I mean, they're giving deals. Like we just heard, Tiffany Haddish just got a deal as well, and I mean, they're opening up things to comics, and you know, for them to open up a door like that. What are you? What are your honest thoughts about Netflix? Uh, I. Well, everybody has to understand that Netflix doesn't have an opinion on stand-up comedy. They base what they pay you by the amount mm. of ticket sales for your last tour. I so like Monique's that. last tour had 316,000 tickets. Mm -hmm. Therefore, that's what she got offered. My last tour had $2.4 million, um, million Two tickets. Uh, tickets. tickets. And so that's what the offer was. Wow. So wow. if people understand it, it's not um, personal. Personal. Right. Uh, then they could just, I didn't know that. for free, take their ass to work and get their numbers up. Yeah. Dude, the but last Netflix, time you Netflix was... don't call nobody. That's the joke. The joke is, Netflix ain't giving me, first of all, Netflix ain't call you. Knock it off. <laughs> it's Coca-Cola knocking on people's door to see what type of <laughs> beverage they having today. <laughs> so they go buy those ticket sales. That's That's dope. What else could they go buy? Yeah. What and I thought it was like popularity. Don't, what comedian and... don't think everybody can't wait for their next special? Mm. Mm. <laughs> who, who don't think they got something to say? The fact of the matter is what makes a great comedy special is if 100 people talk at the same time that you're talking, are you saying something different than them people are saying? No. Mm. Because if you are, then you deserve a special. And if you don't, you're going to find out you're not special. Mm -hmm. Because they're going to let you do your special, Gerard Carmichael, but nobody's going to watch it. Mm. Mm. They're wow. going to let you be a star, Lil Rail, but you're ugly. <laughs> and white people don't believe in ugly stars. They think you have to be somebody that women want to sleep with and men want to be. But because we black, they say, oh, you don't even deserve that. So you get Kevin Hart, Lil Rail, Gerard Carmichael, all in a row, Hannibal Burris, just dudes that no woman would talk to in Lenox Mall, something. let alone you making a movie stars. Why? Because you know ain't nobody gonna sleep with him. You only got Tiffany Haddish. She been doing comedy since she was 16. You can't tell me your favorite Tiffany Haddish joke. Why? Because she ain't done a tour yet. Mm -hmm. She ain't done a special. She has not proven the ability to tell jokes back to back for an hour to nobody. And they are already ready to down Monique and up somebody mm -hmm. who has showed them Girls Trip. Did you think she wrote Girls Trip goofball? Right. Or do you think that was already a script and they handed it to her? It, it's up to you, whatever you want to believe. I, I'm the introduction to Tiffany Haddish in the movie School Dance. The clip for School Dance has been seen more times than the movie has. 
That's just a fact. Mm-hmm. But but the movie wow. girl the the girls trip movie. Yes, ma'am. The one with that four would... with with three of our greatest black actresses in it. Right. You mean that one? Right, right. But oh. I'm just saying, Tiffany Haddish. Ma'am, you could have Tiffany, had that role, yeah. and everything that happened would have happened unless you thought you were necessary to write the Saturday Night Live monologue. I'm a writer. I only care about what you write. I don't care about what you read. Everybody can read. That can read. What did you think about the movie? I I laughed from beginning to end. I felt like... I thought it was a great script when mm -hmm. I saw it in 2004. Wow. In 2004. Mm Wow. Wow. I have it. (laughs) <laughs> I'm, 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 but I'm, I'm so happy for her though because that's what it do. That that that's baby, what it do. I, I tear up thinking about the break that her. she got, and to see yeah. her do her thing. She, she passed forty six female Ooh. black comedians that I know personally that I put on tour hmm. who have a hard time getting a chicken sandwich from Chick Fil A after they headline seven shows at a club for twenty five hundred a week. But, but people so, like real, I'm, and that's why they that like. Is that what her. they like? They, they love real oh, because everybody's real. Then so don't trip. No, no, t- they like wherever Tiffany you Haddish at under the sound of my voice. Real. Do you have a real core worker? <laughs> right. Do you have a ratchet friend? Do you right. have a sister? Do you have a cousin? <laughs> Do you have a nephew? <laughs> Do you have a niece? Is they so ghetto? When did that become marketable? Knock it off. They like her because she want to sleep with a white man. That's that's why the only thing she said was, I want to give it to Brad Pitt. The only thing before that in the movie with me is, I, I slept with this white man and I got a white baby. She had a white husband for the 14 years she'd been doing comedy. And then all of a sudden, divorced him. Then said he abused her. Then wrote a book. Then said he didn't. And then now we're at Brad Pitt. So, hey, you can say whatever you want. She said she got a disease for JJ. Don't nobody check for that. I support Linnell, Melanie Camacho, Miss yep. Laura, I, all the people that got skipped over in the list between now and then. It's no shade to nobody. Yeah, Melanie's well take, taken in, yeah. too. People really love Melanie. I love the fact that you took her out on tour. Martin Lawrence took her out on tour. Chris Tucker took Melanie out on tour. And when she comes to Atlanta, she does well. That's well. not the point. The point but is. she's not, the she's not is, there. The point is we are in the only business where, as a black woman, what you look like is not supposed to be held against you. And time and time again, they mm-hmm. show you that you can be sidetracked by anything light-skinned. Mm. Mm. So, knock ah. it off. Mm-hmm. All right, let's take a quick break. Uh, Red Grant again. The People Station View 3, your hair is kind of... That joint was my hair is 19 inches long and I have no perm. You don't. <laughs> Oops. Oh, that's not a perm. No, it is not. Nice lady. That's come, run, come run. Come run one of your gnarled fingers. Well, come here. Well, come here. <laughs> While you on air. Well, well, come on. So they can hear you lie. Come on. Come on. Let me come over here. No, no, no. That's not how that works. Oh, okay. Well, then stay over there. Don't worry. Ain't nobody putting their hands through yours. That's right. They don't have to. Uh-huh. I don't want them to. Get on out of here. You okay? <laughs> Only one of our you hands are, moving while we talk. Are you all right this morning? Are you okay this Red morning? Red Grant, Atlanta Comedy. Tell Wanda to take sure, off them make, headphones and, and that wig. Sure, and make sure. That wig and that headphones come together. And take off them old ass clothes you got on. How about that? Yeah, they're old. Versace, yeah. Uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's she said, Versace. I want to apologize to the people at Versace Collection. <laughs> This is your 2019 summer but, line that but, hasn't but, come but out. You, but you had but, to open it up and but, show us but, it was it, Versace. I wanted to just No, I didn't have to open it, it up. These though. people are on radio. They can't see anything. <laughs> yeah, but you opened it up so we could see it. Yes, we ma'am. See it. Well, happy, happy, and happy. And happy, happy whatever for stores for the Black Lane Bryant. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Very oh, proud. Okay, let's Very play some proud. music real quick if we can. We going to a break real quick? Very All right, proud. cool. We go to a break. Shout out to Forever 21. Yeah. Necklace collection. That's right. Shout out. They don't remember to me for while now, I right? I'm not the right one in Jones though. Get this inmate out of here. If, if, if you can't get your blood pressure down, you can't call me that. Whatever, little mama. If your cholesterol is 600. Whatever, little mama. I'm little mama's baby daddy. No, you little mama. Uh, yes, ma'am. Hey, and what are you, girl? <laughs> 
You probably shouldn't talk about sizes. Oh, that's okay. You big on the radio. That's right. And you're and you're big Turn in it prison. Down. And you're yes, big in prison. I've never been to prison. Uh, you have 19 felonies, times. no convictions. Yeah. Knock yeah. it off. Prison okay. and jail aren't the same. Okay. No, no. Okay. No, no, no. Calm down. No, no, no. Only one of us has $12 worth of jewelry on. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. That all is available. If you want to, if you want to have Wanda's jewelry, please uh, go to sit go or a quick come trip at any cat. point. Come if you buy cat. two packs of Newport 100s, they will give you everything Wanda has on right now for $7.99 and it comes with a free car wash. Won't you come on down? Yes, thank you. Absolutely. We appreciate it. Go the Shay, show starts at 9. Her. Wanda gets to the stage at 9.17. Uh, please Shay. come on down. Go Shay, please come get Miss Cat uh -huh. and do her hair. She's almost out of breath. Be careful now. Even on the radio, you yes. can hear the fact that exercise has crept into her vocabulary. Yeah. Hey, we have little mama. We're done. You already used that one. Don't yeah. repeat your jokes, Fresh Comic. Go ahead. 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 Go